everybody, George here from Paintball Revolution. So I want to do a quick unboxing video of the LV 1.5 just to show you guys what's going on. So let's do it. So right away, if you guys are familiar with Planet Eclipse, this all looks familiar. We've got the cardboard box and then inside it's that lovely case that we're, we've become familiar with. Uh, nice hard shell case. These guys are really robust. And let's open it up. So Planet Eclipse with their, with their marker cases, everything just kind of opens up for you. So you can drink it all in in one shot. And that's what we're looking at here. So on top we have the manual, which usually slides out. And I've commented on this before. I'm a really big fan of this manual. It's got quite a bit going on. So if you're having issues with your marker and you're you know, trying to service it, the manual is a good place to start because they really do go in depth on all these markers. They also have the exploded view with all the parts lists, um, servicing, you know, internals and all. So I think this is a really good resource. Try not to lose it. If you do, it's available online. Uh, also, just keeping in talk with tech and servicing, Planet always includes a parts kit which is pretty extensive. It's got not just your O-rings, but there's also a bolt tip, there's gaskets, uh, there's screws, a lot of great parts in here. You should be able to rebuild your marker no problem, fix any leaks, replace O-rings. This is a really good kit. What's also nice is all the O-rings are separated and labeled individually in a tiny little baggie, so it's, it's really a great uh, inclusion. Try not to lose that as well. Also, there is a light rammer in this one for the LV 1.5. If you want to replace the rammer that comes pre-installed with that light one, it's here in the spare parts kit. There it is. Um, still talking about tech, we have the Eclipse Allen tool set. These are pretty sought after. Uh, I'm, I'm also a fan of them just because of the housing itself that holds all the Allens. On the bottom actually has a place where you can take an Allen key out and plug it in on the bottom and it makes like a T-handle so that you can get some extra torque. Now, that being said, if you're having to put a bunch of strength into turning something, you might be turning it the wrong way or it might be cross-threaded, so don't really force anything, but that just kind of gives you good leverage if you need to just break loose a bolt, but you know, don't, don't break your stuff, guys. Be, be gentle with it. Um, also, because we're talking about the uh, LV, it comes with oil, not grease, so that is common with the poppet versus the spool valve. You need to use the oil, not the grease, okay? Um, and then last kind of piece of periphery, we've got the Planet Eclipse branded barrel cover. If you don't already have a barrel cover, they're giving you one. You need to have your barrel covers, guys. So there we go. So on this side, we have the barrel itself the tip and the back, and if you guys are familiar, you do know that the Planet Eclipse barrels are reverse threaded uh, from the tip to the back, so that's that. Now, this case should be able to accommodate the FL barrels. If you guys have one that looks like this, it can take that FL barrel diagonal here as well as your back, so if you want to upgrade to those FL barrels, they're available separately. We have those on the website as well, paintballrevolution.com. So let's take a look at the marker itself. So here we go, the LV 1.5. A lot of, ooh, love that sound. All right, so a lot of what you're already familiar with, it is the poppet valve. So that's what's going on up there. That's the bolt itself. And it's connected to that rammer that I was talking about earlier. It's down inside of here. And um, uses the AT pipe. We've got the eye covers for you know cleaning your eyes, accessing your detents and everything. And this pops ASA. Now, I've heard people uh, have some concerns about the ASA being hard to close to actually engage the air. That's mainly because of ball valves on the regs, but usually if you get a hold of that and you give it a good squeeze, it'll engage. But what's really cool about the POPS ASAs is when you're ready to degas, you just press it, pops open, and you're nice and safe. So that is a really neat item, uh, rather than a lever or twitch or twist or a latch or whatever. So the POPS ASA is great. Um, and then of course, we've got the OLED display. 
as you can see. If you guys are familiar with the Planet Eclipse displays, same guy. So there it is, guys. That is the LV 1.5. And these are available on the website in many different colors. We also do color swaps. So if you guys are looking for something top end, you want a nice pop it marker and you're a big fan of Planet Eclipse, this is the one for you. So go ahead and hop on the website at paintballrevolution.com. Check out everything we have to offer. Pick one up today. Uh, and if you guys have any questions, please feel free to get a hold of us. We love hearing from you. Uh, we love answering your questions. So get a hold of us however you can. And as always, guys. Thank you for watching.